reality is, and you know, be very, since I'm among friends here, I'll be very honest. Um, yeah, I eat one meal a day, and that's just because I do feel sluggish if I eat more than that. Now, that meal is a prodigious proportion. It's, uh, I describe it as anything I can reach until I fall asleep. So, you know, it's just a habit I got in many, many years ago. And so it's just one of those things. Um, in terms of the amount of sleep, I slept about that because that's how much time I had. If I had more time, I'd be happy to sleep more. And I, you know, I certainly, when I get the chance to do, but I did find out that that's about the balance that I needed to at that point to do the things I did. And so what I tried to do was hit a balance that made me feel right. I got up early in the morning and worked out because that was important for me to get the day going. Then I had some quiet time alone to work. Then I did most of the day and visit troops and all. And then in the evenings, I start to fade in, in energy. And so what I learned to do was put those things that don't require analytical thought later in the day. I mean, guys would learn not, my staff would learn not to come to me for really good decisions at night. But I could sign stuff. I mean, I could do, you know, those kinds of things. Um, yeah. I mean, you got to know your limitations. Uh, but I also learned to have people around me that really understood. I was very transparent about my battle rhythm and strengths and weaknesses that could fill in the gaps but could also know when I'm best in the day, how much sleep I need. I had a certain you know, guy I worked with that just was very protective of that. At times, he'd say, stop it, go to bed. You know, that sort of thing is important. I think all those things are really important on a couple levels. One, when you're in an organization, people want to know that you are somebody that they have respect for. I think if your life is, if your health is in a shambles, if your finances are in a shambles, if your personal life's in a shambles, you're not going to build as much confidence in them as if you got your act together. So it's just like if they see you cheat on, their tax, on your taxes and they wonder how you're going to deal with them in a business sense, they're going to do the comp you know, the calculation, if he lies to the US government, he might lie to me too. All those things matter, and I think you don't need to make a big publicity about it. People will watch you enough to know whether you're, you've kept up, but it's not something just for you, you owe it to them. Change lives, change organizations, change organizations, change the world.